Look at Shireen. She has cut her finger, trying to sharpen a pencil with a blade. Is it right to sharpen a pencil using a blade or a knife? You want to sharpen your pencil? Can you tell which of the instruments is the safest to use? Accidents happen because of our carelessness and that of others around us. Safety in the house Look at Tanya. She's not doing the right thing. Someone spilled water on the floor and forgot to wipe it. Look what happened to the person who did not know this. Rahul is trying to take out the toast which has got stuck in the toaster. He's trying to pull it out. What do you think can happen? What should he do first? See the nails, the saw and the screwdriver lying on the floor. What might happen if someone stumbles on these? Little Priya is pulling at her mother's sari while she is cooking. Is it right? What do you think might happen? Safety rules to be followed at home. Never leave objects like nails, scissors, toys or balls lying on the floor. Someone might get hurt or trip and fall. Never handle any electrical instrument which is not working properly without first switching it off. Never go near fire unless there is an adult present. Do not distract your mother or any other person while she or he is cooking. If you have to use a stool to reach a high shelf, see that the stool is of the right height. It should be strong and sturdy. If water spills on the floor, it should be wiped off immediately to prevent someone from slipping on it. Safety Rules in School Do not push others while going up or down the stairs. Do not push others while playing. If you get hurt while playing, inform your teacher. She will take care of you. Do not rush to get into the school bus. Wait for your turn. Always remember these simple rules. In case of an accident, never panic. Stay calm and look for help. If you have cut your finger, apply an antiseptic. Take a piece of cotton wool and hold it on the cut. If it is bleeding heavily, do seek the help of an adult. In case of a burn, hold the burn part under a running tap or apply ice. In case there is a sprain, apply ice. Later, apply an anti-inflammatory cream to reduce swelling and pain. Then, see a doctor. If you are feeling thirsty after spending some time in the sun, do not drink water immediately. Sit under the fan Wash your face and hands with cold water. If you are feeling giddy, lie down. If you are feeling very sick, see a doctor. Safety on the road 
Safety rules to be followed on the road. Walk on the footpath if there is one. If there is no footpath, walk on the right side of the road. Then you will be able to see the oncoming vehicles. Cross the road only when the traffic has stopped. Cross the road only at the zebra crossing. Look right, then left, then right again before crossing the road. Do not run on the road. Do not get into or off a moving bus. Safety rules to be followed during Diwali. Do not light firecrackers unless there is an adult present. Keep a bucket of water nearby. Wear only cotton clothes. Synthetic materials like nylon and rayon catch fire easily. Do not light crackers which produce a loud sound. This disturbs not only people but also animals. Remember, by rule, you are supposed not to light firecrackers after 10 p.m. If a firecracker fails to explode, do not go near it to light it a second time. It might explode and cause harm. People have gone blind because of this careless action. First aid The immediate help given to an injured person is called first aid. Immediate help Remember these simple things. Do not panic or get scared. It is very important to stay calm and help the injured person also to calm down. Do not crowd around the injured person. Let him or her breathe. If the injured person is bleeding, clean the wound first with water, then with an antiseptic lotion. Use a clean handkerchief or bandage to cover the wound. In case of a burn, we should hold the burned part under cold water or apply ice to it.